Hey everyone, this is Spicewell7 from the Gamers Emporium. Today I'm going to be taking you into the Create a Class uh, section for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. So when you go into the Create a Class section, you'll be greeted by uh, five custom slots that you can designate into whatever you want. We're going to go right into the one I've already preordained to be the one for this video, which is going to be this one. Now, if you've played Black Ops 2, then you know exactly what's coming. If you look at the top, you'll see the 13 slots, the zero that have been taken, and basically each thing that you put on in each of these slots dictates how many uh, slots you have left. So, if we were going to put in some sort of a gun. Let's go with um, uh, my favorite's always been the ARX 160. I like the burst fire on that one, and plus it's also really accurate. So we're gonna put that one on. And uh, so if you can see at the top of the screen, there's a one of 13 because one of the slots has been taken over by the primary weapon. Now let's add in some attachments. Um, I'm pretty partial to the iron sight, so I really don't need anything like that. Uh, if, I were, if I were ever going to take a secondary, I always take the uh, RW1, which is a uh, railgun hand cannon. It's really nice. And then uh, put in a, um, what's it called, red dot sight. All right, so we're already at five out of 13, so we only got a couple more. Um, let's see for perks. Ch -ch -ch Danger close. Okay. Um, uh, move faster for that one. peripherals and toughness so we're at 8 of 13 now so not too many left I don't ooh the score streaks do count I did not know this huh that's news to me I always thought they were just uh there that actually could make things pretty interesting so obviously it's very customizable like you can do quite a bit with this um Alright, well, let's say we were going to get rid of that and that. Actually, that entirely. So we have nine, a couple left. Alright, what could we do here? Well, let's go with primary gunfighter. Take a third attachment for my primary weapon. See how that goes. Okay. So I already got the foregrip, the quick draw. What about a stock? Ooh, that increases mobility. I like that. And then we got one more. Uh, what should we put here? We could put another score streak, but I don't really, uh, now that I know that those don't exactly need to be up. Actually, can we go... Okay, so I think we got one more. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what to put on here. Actually, you know what? We'll just go with the orbital care package. Um... What do we have for a secondary? No attachments available for that? Okay. So let's try something else. Nope, nope. Oh, too far. Um, <clears throat> uh, a Kimbo wouldn't be very good. Uh, let's go with that. And that's um, pretty much it. Looks like we found out some new things in there that I'm going to have to try out on, the, out on the battlefield. Not much for score streaks, so it could be pretty interesting. Hmm. Well, that's basically it for the creative class. I also wanted to dive in into some of the uh, other stuff that you can do. Your character now is now fully customizable with different loadouts that you can get. All right, so this one is mine currently. So let's go with the basic stuff completely, and then we'll go from there. Okay, so this would be like a basic... Nice hair, bro. This would be like a basic setup of what your character can potentially look like. So let's start at the top. 
eyewear. Um, not really anything that stands out to me. Oh, these look like oh, they are offshoot. I think that's supposed to be Oakley's. All right, so let's go with the helmet. I personally like the beanie. That was pretty good looking. Uh, yeah. I like that. Uh, keep in mind that the different, like the uh, see where it says Atlas campaign loadout. That means I've completed the the campaign itself in order to obtain that. That's pretty cool. Uh, I like that one. I think that was the one I had last time, wasn't it? No, this was. I'm pretty sure. No, this was. Okay. Alright, gloves. Um, I like those. Those look pretty good. And I know I had these ones on. Boots. Not a hell of a difference. And then your XO. Alright, that's uh, pretty much for that. And then you also have uh, emblems and player cards and whatnots. What's this one? Heartbreaker. Interesting. Ninja? I don't know what that is. Hmm. Feed greed. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um. Yeah, not much of them are uh, unlocked, but I do like the one that I chose, the uh, the bombshell, so to speak. All right, I think that's pretty much it. All right, well, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this uh, quick video of about create a class and some of the other customizations you guys can do in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and definitely check out our Facebook at facebook.com forward slash the gamers emporium and like, subscribe, comment, do what you gotta do. Have a great time guys.